SEC Challenge tonight in Lubbock as the Texas Tech Lady Raiders play host to the LSU Lady Tigers. Say Caldwell with her first shot tonight, and she hits it. And that's a good sign. One thing that I know she's really been working on is just being patient, running the offense, but at the same time being aggressive looking for her shot. Inside the arc, not, and not outside the arc, because they don't shoot threes very well. Weaving her way through the lane is Ayanna Mitchell. Once they break the press, they need to be aggressive and attack the press and try to get some easy looks and not pull it out and run a half-court set. Rose throws it inside to Jada, outside to Bree, and she hits the three. Once they break the press, they need to be aggressive and attack the press and try to get some easy looks and not pull it out and run a half-court set. Rose throws it inside to Jada, outside to Bree, and she hits the three. And you hope that that extra focus for her will help the Lady Raiders. On the baseline, it's up and it is in. Coach Whitaker said she was like that as a player, that she used a lot of energy early. Nice Bree move. Blair goes right down the boulevard and lays it up and in. Playing in the paint. They like to get their points in the paint. They've, they've lived off of that. Inside they go, and it is off the glass and good. Here's Hayden. Back to Zuri Sanders. Zuri looking inside for nice. Brittany Brewer. Puts it up nice and pass. good. And she took her time there. Bree Blair will put it up just inside the lane, missing. Rebound. Nice Zuri, hustle, Zuri. Inside with a left hand hook by Brittany Brewer, and she's got it. And the Lady Raiders are down by just one after all that exchange. They can find a way to get Dio an easy bucket. Hopefully, that'll be able to, to get her started going on offense again. And dump it down in the paint. A little left handed nice. shot there by Raging Lewis. And yeah, the Lady Raiders need a bucket here. Here's Rose Caldwell trying to go from distance, and she makes it happen. She goes long distance there for the Lady Raiders and gets a three ball to go. And from Rose Caldwell, and she's denied, but she'll go back to Rose. Let's see if she can hit it again. She cannot. Bree nice. Blair, though, underneath to get it and off the glass and in. To Ola Bodie, to Brewer, to That's Terry. Nice. Reverse layup, good. Good That's passing there. Basketball. Mm -hmm. On the inbounds, Bree Blair looks like she passed with a shot. Rose Caldwell will get one and turns around and hits it. Here's Regine Lewis with a reverse layup good. Lewis, who has 13, make it 15. It will be Lindsay in the paint, gets a shot to fall. And they should be, they should pick up. Yeah, they're almost getting to a point where you're gonna have to do some fouling, but that won't really do you any good. And Regine Lewis pulls up and hits the wing jumper. Caldwell can't get a shot off, tries to dump it down to Terry. Terry lays it up and in. And it'll give yourself a chance to win this ball game. Will be underneath, throws it to Dial Bodhi. She hits it with 1.8 to go, and that will do it. 48 to 40 is our final here tonight at United Supermarkets Arena as Texas Tech drops to four, to three, and three on the season.